Hello there. So this video is going to be a little quick fix for a common issue for AMD users trying to get stable diffusion on their desktops. So um, just to clarify, uh, like as a disclaimer, if you do, like this only works on AMD cards, the 6000 or 7000 series. So if you have a 5000 series card, I don't think you'll be able to do stable diffusion, the direct ML. So, I would recommend you to watch this video. I'm not going to make this video isn't going to be like a whole guide on how to get stable diffusion because I feel like this video by Rising Phoenix does it extremely well. I would really recommend you watch him. It's a very like in-depth guide and it's really easy to follow and especially like he uses uh, this program called Git, uh, Tortoise Kit. I think it's very helpful. So please watch this tutorial if you want to know how to get it. But um, a common error you'll run into, most likely if you use an AMD GPU is the runtime error saying that Torch is not able to use GPU at blah blah blah. So you can see someone in the comments have um, provided the solution, but he doesn't really like. Uh, he, he tells you to use Notepad, but that might be a little bit ambiguous to some of you, especially me, because I didn't know like what this mean that what this meant like how am I supposed to even like add this you know, so once you have the um, DirectML file downloaded scroll all the way down to web UI slash uh, no dash user so not not any of these it has to be web UI slash you dot oh my god dash user and it's gonna be the Windows batch file so what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on it and then you're gonna right click it alright you're gonna press show more options and you're gonna press edit so right below open press edit it'll bring you to a notepad I'll bring this over to my monitor so this is the notepad it should bring you to and this is here because it's in the video so what you want to do is go down to set command line ARGS and here I'll minimize this and what you want to do is type in these two commands use directml and reinstall torch so what this does is it not only resolves this runtime error it also makes sure that uh, direct Stable Diffusion runs on your GPU. So, like, especially with AMD guys trying this, a lot of you guys will, if you don't do this step, uh, Stable Diffusion will actually use your CPU, and which that just doesn't sound very good, right? Because your CPU, it might not even have graphics. I mean, at best, integrated graphics. So you want to run it off your Radeon GPU. So put these two command line in, and that's how you do it. 